Watch lovers, this is Swiss Watch Expo, and this week we're taking a look at three amazing green dial watches. Stick around. Welcome back to Swiss Watch Expo. This is Angel, and every week, you know, we come at you with some really great timepieces. So this week, we're gonna take a look at some green dial watches, perfect for going from winter to spring, and really timeless designs that have a little touch of uniqueness to them. So let's get right into it. So my first pick, I think this is an absolutely gorgeous and unique timepiece. It is the Cartier Santos with the Arabic dial. So usually when you hear the Arabic dial, we're looking for those numbers that are very easy to read in English, but this is actually truly in the Arabic language. So you'll have those indices, or I shouldn't say indices, those numbers right around the dial. They're applied to this beautifully high finished green, almost a forest green dial. Your date will be at the six also in the Arabic numerals. So that's going to be very beautiful to watch throughout the month. And then the bezel, the bezel on this one is an ADLC coated bezel. So that's a morphic diamond like coating, the most durable type of bezel that's out there right now. It's going to be a little different than the PVD coating where it can actually scrape off over time. This is very, very hard on the bezel here, 40 millimeters across beautiful rubber strap. So it makes it very comfortable to wear, but you'll still have a nice butterfly clasp with the uh, buttons to push here on the back. So gorgeous watch. And instead of the blue, you'll have the green faceted stone here on the crown, which I think is also a nice touch. Very rare to see a different color there on the Cartier crowns. You'll see the blue, you'll see diamond, but the green is one that I don't see very often. So next up, we'll get right into this stunning IWC chronograph Spitfire edition. So this watch I love because not only is it green, it has that gorgeous bronze case, which I think complements the green in an absolutely beautiful way. So, and on top of that, you'll also have every function that you need on this pilot's watch. You'll have your day, you'll have your date, you'll have your chronograph features, the beautiful, beautiful white hands that have that super luminova finish to them. So it'll show up really, really nicely as you're uh, in the low light situations. And the bronze is just gonna look better and better over time. Coming in at 41 millimeters, I feel like that's the new, um, almost common size. I feel like it's almost replacing the 36 or the 39, but still not too bulky, just a really great size for everyday wear. And on the strap, again, it looks gorgeous with that bronze and green combination. I think this is a really gorgeous, uh, sporty watch for someone who wants the chronograph features, but wants it to have that kind of uh, conversational appeal behind it. And then of course, last but not least, I absolutely love this Omega here. So this is going to be your Globe Master annual calendar. This watch is done in the stainless steel, but the bezel is in titanium carbide, which is double the strength of steel, just as stiff, if not stiffer, and really going to lend itself to allowing that fluted bezel to wear beautifully over time. You won't really see a lot of nicks or dings and things like that with it. And then of course, in combination with that steel that has that almost satin finish, but high polished on the edges, the beveled edges, I should say near the lugs and on the side of the case. Now, this is absolutely gorgeous because the green is not overly green, too much in your face. It's still very neutral. And the positioning of the dates, um, or I'm sorry, the date here at the six, and then the months around the bezel, around the dial, really is a unique way to display the month. And it does automatically jump every month. So you really don't have to deal with resetting this watch other than for that short month of February. Otherwise, it's going to correct every month. So 30 or 31 days, you're good to go, which I think is great for an annual calendar like this. 
and also just a really clean dial. The Globemaster is, of course, the first master chronometer that ever existed. It came out in about 2014, 2015. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I want to say it was 2015 that that came out. Superluminova indices, 41 millimeter. And this watch came in, I believe, eight different uh, colorways, but the green is my favorite. So gorgeous annual calendar from Omega. They only do the best of the best. And then the back will have that... Uh, constellation insignia at the top and then that beautiful exhibition case back so again gorgeous piece three great models and i would love to hear some of your favorite green dial models you know i had to choose between the sprite which was a really really big contender for me and also the john mayer which we have here as well so let me know what your three favorite models are and we'll see you next week on our next video.